The season of giving brings opportunities to help provide those basic needs for those in need. Yeah, Bela, and that's so important, especially this time of year. But what about the wants? A new toy or cool outfit or simple pleasures that many children in foster care don't get the luxury of having. News 4's Caroline Gerhardt tells us about a national nonprofit that's working to change that. When Danielle Glito and her husband first became foster parents, their hearts changed. To see how difficult it was for these children to enter this system, move through the system, and the underlying thing we saw was, you know, they, they really just wanted to be kids. One simple wish was born, to give foster kids across the country not just what they need, but what they want. And those who might not be able to foster a chance to help. And so many people wanted to help, but just didn't have a really simple and direct way to do that. When you go to onesimplewish.org, you can see all of the wishes that are waiting to be granted. But you're also learning a little bit more about these children in foster care, like how Mary wants to go see Moana too, or how Aman needs a new pair of jeans for his school dance. So it's almost like you're taking the gift right off the web page and putting it in the hands of a child in foster care. Ashley Vaughn is a board member for One Simple Wish and an aspiring foster parent. One of my favorite childhood memories is visiting one of my mom's friends who was a foster parent and I just was fascinated that she had all these kids who like were from different backgrounds, different races, and I just love this like non-traditional concept of family. Staggering statistics prompted Vaughn to take action. There are about half a million children in the country who are in the foster care system, 100,000 of them who are waiting to be adopted. It kind of like lit a, a, I don't know, a brighter fire under me to really help out here. The program's goal is simple. We are so honored to be able to provide those little sparks of joy to these children, especially, we do it year round, but especially during the holiday season. We, we share stories and we don't make this about you know, the negative or the trauma, but really about the hope and the possibility. And we find that that just connects so many people. Sparks of joy and moments of possibility through wishes granted. No genie or lamp required. In Dothan, I'm Caroline Gerhardt, your hometown news leader. To learn how to submit or grant wishes or how your organization can partner with One Simple Wish, you can visit this story on our website. That's WTVY.com.